Welcome to That'sCoolWire.com. In this video, we are really, really, really excited to show you our new EL Wire mount. Um, we have so many different designs we're coming up. We're going to call them the EL Wire designer mounts. So just a real quick, if you look up here, these are just some of the other mounts we're doing, but we're going to end up with a bunch more. Um, these are for if you're putting them on costumes and you want to design. We have the heart shape, the flower shape, the long mounts. But for this video, we're going to focus on the disc mount. And for this particular disc mount, we ended up putting four circles on here. So let me just show you some of the features of this disc mount. Um, when you get these, you may see two different looks. You can see this one kind of looks like a little bit rough. And this one looks a little bit smoother. It just depends on the material we're using. You may get either one. You can't select which one you're going to get. But we also have multicolored. Um, I mean, when I say multicolored, you can get a red one or a blue one or a white one. Uh, we just happen to use the black one here. But it doesn't matter what the finish looks like. They are all rock solid. So it, that part you don't have to be concerned about. How would you mount these? We uh, put four sewing mount holes on here. So it's one there, one there, one there, and one here. And if we look through it, if we zoom in, you probably can see through it that uh, there's two holes that you can just put it on the fabric and sew that on. To actually get the wire in here, what you're going to end up doing, and we'll turn this one around, is put the wire in from the back, and I'll show you how to mount one of these, or put the wire in the circle. But if it's on your clothing, you're either going to put a slit in your clothing or the backpack, put these wires through, then make your connections, and then either glue this or sew it on. Or you can just put four little holes, put the wires through, again, glue it or sew it on, and then work with your connectors uh, behind the fabric. So with these, if you're going to go ahead and just do a circle, I'll just uh, demonstrate. And we'll just pick this one right here. So what I'm going to do is just pick this hole. I put the wire through. This is the 2.6. Put a lot of wire through and more than enough to go all the way around. Take the end now and push it up against where you inserted the wire. So now you know when it ends, it's going to be perfectly flush with that. Pop it in. And then you're just going to work your way around this circle. So as you get closer, you start pulling this wire through the hole and then you just push down, push down, push down and then here if it pops out a little bit you can just get like a little um, tool or just your, use your fingernail to really push it down and so now you end up with a really nice clean circle and then you would do the same thing with the other, uh, the other three. Now if you only wanted to use two of them, then you can just use two. So that's the beauty of this. You can use all four, just use one, use all you know, three of them, it doesn't matter. So what makes these really, really special, I think, is that the inverters is what's going to make the effect. On this particular one, um, we're just using our sequencer. It's a four output uh, port sequencer. And you can mix these up so it doesn't have to be in this order. But we also put a three foot extension on this one just to show you that if you're going to have this here and maybe you want the inverter down maybe by your waist, you may want to put the three foot extension on there. If not, you just take it off. Um, these connectors right here will just plug right into here so you'll have a shorter distance. Okay, so we're going to just turn the light off real quick to show you this pattern. The camera may go blurry, maybe not, but once it does, you'll kind of get to see the effect. Freestyle it. If this fits your costume and you really like this effect, you can put multiple um, discs on your costume, put them on backpacks, you can put them on your thighs, on a hat. It really doesn't matter what, but this is the effect. You can change the order of the sequence by just mixing the connector. So maybe you don't want it from going from in to out, you want it to go from out to in, you just actually just reverse the connectors. So again, what we're going to do now is show you um, how to use other inverters. And so like we said, we're 3D printing these. So we do have a job right now that's, uh, that we're printing. I'm going to switch the inverter and we'll show you a little bit of the 3D printer right now. As you can see, it's printing. So as you're coming back, you'll see me just snap these wires into the inverter. This is just going to be a different effect. So again, the first one was the sequencer. All we have here is our AA inverter. And so um, when I 
click this once, you can see that they're all blinking. Again, it may be going in and out of focus because sometimes the camera takes a second. You have a slower blink, and then you have it on constant. So if that's the effect you're looking for, and again, your color combination is endless. You can use all the same color. You can change your colors. It really doesn't matter. And the other thing that you can do is use our 9 volt inverter. It has a dimmer on it. Or if you wanted to, you can hook up the sound inverter so it reacts to sound. I don't want to get too complicated, but you can really have fun with this. For example, you can put a two output splitter on the sound inverter and connect it to, I don't know, it doesn't matter, the first two. So these two, whenever it hears sound, it'll react. And then you can use the double A inverter with the two output splitter for the last two that either stay on constant. So the effects are really endless based on the inverter. So again, we're really, really excited about all the mounts we're coming up with. It makes it really easy. It's really clean now to get some really cool designs. So we really do appreciate you watching this video. If you have any questions or if you need a custom mount made for you, maybe you need one with six circles, eight circles, a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller. You can have an L shape. It doesn't matter what you're looking for. We also do the design work and we can print it out. We really appreciate you watching this video at thatscoolwire.com. And if you have any questions, call us toll free 866-435-9473.